So, the children are so happy. They just can't wait for those humans coming to stay on the school exchange. Just so long as they remember how weird humans can be. Uh, and then I'll take them on a ghoul hunt in the cemetery. Uh, I collect lots of bones and worms and stretch out to sleep on the gravestone. <laughs> hmm. Perhaps they're looking forward to this just a little too much. There's nothing wrong with being happy, my slime heart. Oh. No. But something tells me tomorrow is going to be a tough day. about happiness. If I could only catch up with the old crowd again. Hmm. Looks like a new exhibition at the museum. Just what I need, a little taste of home. You're coming with me, Colonel. Hmm. Let's see. A mummy and an explorer with a shrunken head wandering around the museum. <laughs> that ought to get a reaction, all right. Just a quick word. Humans, exchange visit today. Need to pretend. Normal human family. That's it, humans. Yuck. Side with the others this morning. Well, we best grab it before the boss finds out. <laughs> Brilliant strategy. <laughs> said anything about a rescue mission? This is pure reconnaissance. But these could be my cousins! No, Tut. Please, Colonel. Please, 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 please! <laughs> Why do I never listen to you? Quick reminder, 
Remember, children, best behavior for our visitors. Best human behavior, of course. Rear entrance. <laughs> children getting on. That's just it, Dad. They're a bit, well, odd. <laughs> I've never heard anything so ridiculous. <laughs> Surely you're used to humans and their strange ways by now. <laughs> odd, <laughs> indeed. <laughs> you're the expert, and humans can be so hard for us to understand. 
Maybe they're just trying to fit in. Would you eat earwig and snail slime just to fit in, Sam? Point taken. Come on, Fungus. We've simply got to do everything we can to make them feel at home. I'll drop by as soon as I get back from town. I'm sure they'll settle in soon enough, though. Good luck. Ah, that's better. <laughs> I'd go bonkers if I had to keep up that sweet little voice much longer. <laughs> <laughs> At least we're not in those awful boxes. Four thousand years I've been waiting for a good scratch. Oh. We're not going back. Not ever. I could certainly get used to it around here. Very comfy. And they're all so easy to fool. What about the kids? Don't worry, we'll take care of them soon enough. <laughs> what do you want? Don't you ever knock? We're like so bored with you. <sighs> Some kind of exchange this is turning out to be. Shows just how much you know, Frogface. <laughs> the exchange will come soon enough. Okay, now you really have asked for it. <laughs> no, Fungus, you can't. You mustn't. Shall we? Absolutely. <laughs> For real, we need to warn mom and dad. Mom, mom they're, they're not human. human. They're really, really weird. weird. <laughs> but of course they're weird, my darlings. They're human exchange students. Ah, there they are. How is everything, my little sweets? Fine, thank you. <laughs> we are very happy here. Oh. <sighs> What are you pair talking about? Frog spawn wouldn't melt in their mouths. <laughs> Got the blighters caught. If we divide here, we can attack from both sides and trap them. Oh. Try to look inconspicuous, won't you? My name is 
fungus. Now for some real fun. <laughs> what on earth are we gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> Is it now? Two are in big trouble. Oh. Rangers, we have to speak to you. <gasps> you frightened the children. Go away. <laughs> oh, just get them out of there. Jeez. Things aren't going good then. Just wait until those brats are gone. And we're here in their place. <laughs> Good afternoon. Uh, um, oh, oh, oh. Oh? They've gone. So tell me, what was the problem? <laughs> problem? Oh my, not at all. Everything's been absolutely fine. <laughs> the little darlings. <laughs> have behaved themselves perfectly. An inspiration to us all. <laughs> but I don't quite understand. As my wife was just saying, such delightful little hum... Children, quite. No problems at all. But they never even came into the hotel. Apparently, they saw something that scared them. <laughs> Such fertile imaginations, these young children. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Anyway, no harm done. Oh, don't forget the museum visit this afternoon. All the children are to be there. <laughs> Nothing to worry about now. Everything is going to be fine from now on. Nothing scary, I promise you. I say, Rictus, old chap, something we need to confer about. Hello. Surprise. Here's that slime time I promised you. Would anyone please tell me what is going on around here? <laughs> Looks like he doesn't want to know about Tip and Tap after all. But something tells me we do. Tip and Tap? Demons from ancient Egypt. Yeah, shapeshifters. Let them out by mistake, you know. But now we can't find them. I think we need to hear more about this. A lot more. What does this say? Really must get my eyes tested before another century goes by. Tut! Uh, oh, uh, yes, of course. Uh, the legend of Tip and Tap, doomed to darkness for all time, unless they can provide two young victims to replace them. Well, oh. go on. That's it, I'm afraid. Sorry, guys. It's been nice knowing ya. And this? Hmm? Oh, uh, some kind of sacred chant. <laughs> Humor him. Then we get the kids, and they'll be finished. Ah, there you are. Hello. I really must apologize. That's quite all right. <laughs> you see, things aren't usually like uh, this. We are, in fact, very normal. <laughs> 
very average human beings. Of course. It's all been a bit of a, a prank, you see. But Fungus and Maggot are very sorry, and everything is going to be fine from now on. We're all going to make friends, and things are going to be so normal. Go! what humans can do these days. children. <laughs> Must be a relief to have two such normal kids as us in the class. <laughs> 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 